right what's going on guys what's going on welcome back to the channel welcome back hope you guys are enjoying your time watching these last kingdom season three episodes man because i know i'm having a blast here we are today with the final two episodes of the season nine and ten i'm glad that they extended the season beyond eight um episodes not that i um hated episode one and two because you know i love those seasons but i'm glad that they extended it to 10 episodes at least i love if, if you're gonna make a season short i think 10 episodes is that way and netflix does that with it with its show i love that right sometimes they do eight too sometimes they do 10 like with the witcher they did eight eight episodes um you know um, i don't mind it as long as the show is really good you know what I'm saying? You can go for eight episodes. I don't have no problem with that, but I like 10. 10, look, it just, it's a nice round number. You know what I'm saying? It's a nice round number to go for. And you can get a lot done in 10 hours. You can tell a story in 10 hours. You get what I'm saying? I love that. So, you know, um, if it's, if it's like a, you know, like the Game of Thrones final season episodes where it's like only got six episodes, but each of the episodes is like an hour and a half. So, you can't complain about that. You're getting a movie practically for every episode, a movie length wise for every episode. So you can't complain about six episodes. I just think they could, even though it was six episodes, I think they could have done better with the season. Of course, a lot of people, the majority of people that watched Game of Thrones and loved it did not like that ending. And you know what I'm saying? If you think that it's the other way around, you need to check yourself. <laughs> but anyways, um, let's jump into these final episodes, man. I want to see this conversation between Alfred and Uhtred. I'm chomping at the bit. Let's get it. Make sure you like the video. Don't forget to do that. If you don't forget to do it. Okay. Like the video. I need these videos to start doing at least 200 views um, by in 24 hours, man. Let's get it. Let's get it. I'll see you guys next time later for the review. All right, so here we are. Season three is done. I will be starting season four <laughs> pretty soon. I'm trying to get all everything done for at least this show so that I can move on to doing the next show, which I think I already said what the next show is going to be. But if I haven't um, and you want to know, it's going to be dark. So don't worry about it. Don't worry. Um, it's going to be dark. Dark is like in their like third season. I think they just finished if I'm not mistaken. I think they just put out the third season or something like that. It's, it is a Netflix show too. Um, I haven't checked it out yet, but people have been telling me about it. So I'm going to check it out due to the fact that I know that it's very short seasons. And that's the only reason why I'm kind of trying to knock out these TV shows because eventually I'm probably going to get tangled up into another long series like say you know the walking dead again so i want to knock out these small shows that you guys have been suggesting that you know they're not too far ahead where i can't catch up um so yeah so that's for that but anyways let's talk about season three of the last kingdom the last kingdom season three is the best hands down no mistaken the best season of the show so far um, I don't know, as I said, I don't want to credit this to Netflix because they probably brought on the same writers, the same, maybe a new director. I don't know. Cause I'm not checking the credits like that. So I don't know, but all I know is, I don't know if it's the Netflix fever, but all I know is this season, you can feel the difference in the switch. Maybe it's because they could have, they know that all the episodes are going to come out at once. So they just. You get what I'm saying? Put a little bit more oomph into it. But other than that, man, as I said, everything about the season was very well done from beginning to end, from from Skade to Ethelwald dying. You know what I mean? So it was very well done. Everything about the season was well done. I have nothing. There was no plot holes 
whatsoever for me to nitpick at, for me to say, okay, they could have done that better. Everything was done perfectly. I don't think I've ever said that about a series that I've watched on the channel. I don't think I've ever said it, maybe think it, but never said it. This is nothing short of perfection, just like season two, but season three was better. If I could give it a 10.5, I would. <laughs> That's, you know what I'm saying? To distinguish it from season two, um, season two was perfect also, but season three, was, it, they just took it up a notch with the perfection, if there's such a thing, right? So, I enjoyed the season, man. Um, so, R.I.P. Thura, R.I.P. King Alfred, you know, at the world. You know what I'm saying? It's not R.I.P. You know what I'm saying? It's not R.I.P. to him. It's good riddance. <laughs> it's good riddance. You know what I mean? So, um, everything was just so well done. The scenes that they gave us at the end of the season with with King Alfred and, 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 and Uhtred, man. Man, they they killed those scenes. They killed those scenes, man. I I have to give them props for that. And as I said, I wanted to shout out the writers on this video, man. Um, I wanted to shout out the writers. Um, so let me see if I can find their names here. All right, we got the art director. Man, shout out to everybody in the in the in the um in the um the crew man shout out to everybody they did an incredible job on this season everybody except for the the custom the costume design <laughs> the costume designers need they need help bruh the only person they care about is elswith you know what i'm saying everything i'm i'm just making fun guys they did an incredible job they did an incredible job i'm looking for the writers um, okay, visual effects, they, they they did a pretty good job too. I'm just looking to see if there was more than one person right in the show. If they give credit to anybody. Alright, we got the casting director. Um, hair and makeup. Okay, let's get to the writer, man. Jesus. <laughs> Music vocals, producer, associate, I don't, the producer's. Are you kidding me right now? They don't show me who writes the show? You're kidding me, right? Aren't they supposed to show? Man, if you don't get off my damn... Uh, God damn it. Anyways, um... Shout out to the writers. I'll look it up after this, who wrote the season. Or the writers that wrote the season and give them credit maybe in the description or something. Um, but... Yeah, man, pretty cool stuff. They did an incredible job. I don't want to go over the entire season talking about each individual event from, you know what I'm saying, from Ragnar's death, from the, you know, Uhtred and Alfred's reunion um, and how it was brought about. They, they told the story in a way where it's not stuff not jumping from here to here and you're like what the fuck just happened how did we get here you know what i'm saying it was a step by step story i love when when tv shows do that because nothing feels missing even though you know things are progressing and they're not exactly telling you when things are progressing you feel like it's just a straight forward story you get what i'm saying so i love when tv shows do that man and that's why i can give it a perfect 10 out of 10 because it's just there was nothing missing there was nothing missing there was nothing out of place everything was done extremely well you know and you know we lost gizla there's so much that happened in the season but everything was done extremely well i'm saying that a lot i know but i i can't find any more words to to describe the perfection that i just watched for these 10 episodes i mean if there was ever a show if there was ever a show that i would say that had a perfect season that i had nothing nothing to complain about game of thrones was that was one of those shows for the first 
four seasons or five seasons, I should say, right? And then here comes the last kingdom, right? I had, there was things that were wrong, wrong with Viking season. And I don't think I gave any of those seasons 10 out of 10. I think the fourth season was the first. I don't remember the ratings that I gave for the seasons. But I know that some of the, I think I gave one of the seasons of Vikings a 10 out of 10. If I, if I'm remembering correctly, I don't remember which one it was, but it was definitely, definitely, I love that season. But it's very rarely that I have two seasons straight, two seasons straight for a TV show that I've watched on this channel that I give a 10 out of 10. That is very rare. Um, so, um, so yeah, I really do appreciate y'all, man, for checking in with this season. This season was absolutely incredible. It made me cry. It made me angry. It made me, you know what I'm saying? All types of emotions, but I'm glad that Alfred found that peace that he should have had a long time ago with, with Uhtred, you know, but as I said, he was a slave to the crown and he was not a slave to the crown when he died. And I'm happy for that. I'm happy that he found the peace, finally telling the truth of how he actually feels about Uhtred, you know, and for, forgiving himself and also, you know, Uhtred forgiving him. And, you, you know, because I know that Uhtred was extremely hurt by everything that was going on between them that every time it's like every time I do something it's like a loyal I want to follow you as you are king I respect you as a king you know what I'm saying but it's like you know it's like I can't do anything right in your eyes and it's not that Uhtred wasn't doing anything right it's just that Alfred just wasn't acknowledging any of it he wasn't acknowledging any of it so for him to finally do that and for what I had hoped for, truly desired for them to do, they did it this season with the both of them. And, you know, I'm, I'm, I'm choking, I'm choking up because I didn't want as much as I kind of knew that Alfred was going to die this season. I didn't want him to die in the series because he's just. As I said, he's my one of my favorite characters. He's top two. You know what I'm saying? He's top two. It's Uhtred and then it's him. And now he's gone. Who's going to jump up to that spot? I don't know yet. Um, you know, it's definitely not going to be Elswith. I tell you that much. At the world is dead. Very well deserving. It was. It's about damn time. You know what I'm saying? So I appreciate um, um, y'all for checking out the season, man. Season four will start next week, no doubt about it. Even though I have not recorded it yet, I'm telling you right now that it will start. As I said, I'm doing all of this stuff um, while I'm taking care of my girl and stuff like that. So I'm doing this in between all that stuff. So whenever this stuff come out is whenever it comes out. I spend a couple of hours, watch these episodes, um, and then I go do my duties <laughs> if you want to call it that it's, you know so it's it's is it's, it's good it's good it's awesome so i don't know um when you guys see this but it as i said it's going to be two episodes um until i catch up which is to season you know to season four um got one more season to go and i'll be all caught up until season five drops um as you guys have told me that they have approved season five okay so one more season to go, and it, you guys will finish it in a week. But you guys are awesome. I appreciate y'all. Make sure you leave a like. Make sure you leave a comment on the video, man. 10 out of 10 season again for The Last Kingdom. Everything in the season was just well done. And as I said, there's nothing for me to complain about. So all I can say is well done. Perfection. You know, and as I said, RIP to those characters. Um, they did a very good job through man thank god she she ended it before the fire actually took her you know um thank you guys so much man i appreciate y'all see you guys for next week peace